O5 Command and the Administrator O5 Command, 13 people who have control over the Foundation Unusual personalities with way too much power They do not and cannot come into contact with any anomalous entities Mostly everyone is afraid of them They know absolutely everything there is to know about the Foundation and its activities They rarely intervene in the containment of SCPs, except when they do they have their own mobile task force, the Red Right Hand. O5 Command are the masters of the Foundation, and not everyone know they exist. Nothing is certain. Especially not us, God no. Maybe. Maybe there are 13, maybe they are people. They're not supposed to come into contact with anomalous entities, but in secret, sometimes they do. Who are they? Where did they come from? What secret goals are they striving towards? Either way, O5 Command is the cornerstone of the Foundation. At the very least, they have the Foundation's best interests at heart. Maybe. The Administrator, figure of little known nature playing a role best understood by O5 Command. Possibly anomalous, possibly multiple people once represented the Foundation in meetings with major world government figures, has since relinquished this role. Why? Maybe you're asking the wrong questions. It's an open secret amongst the upper echelons of the Foundation that the Administrator, as popularly known, never at any point existed, but was a clever fiction created by another person or persons, or, something else, within the Foundation for the purposes of unifying of a fractious organization. As for what should be made of that, no one agrees. Error, unauthorized access detected. You know why you're here. They were never going to give you the whole story. Half of the truth can fool most people, most of the time. They'll just give you enough that you don't keep looking, especially when it comes to the people with the most to hide. If you'd like more than stale breadcrumbs, keep reading. Your friend. Full dossier on O5 Command and the Administrator. Hello, and welcome, friend. Needless to say, you're not supposed to be viewing these files. I say, take a chance. You've come this far. Some of the following information is true. Some of it's false. Even ridiculous. Sometimes I know for sure. Sometimes I don't. Sometimes I'll lie. It doesn't matter. Whatever I've told you here, someone somewhere believes it. And belief has power. Realize also that the O5 Council might not even exist. The content of this dossier is restricted to Personnel and above. System message, security breach identified. Please log out immediately. Overview. The O5 Council. O5 Command. The Overseers Overwatch These are the people who have ultimate control over the Foundation. Each O5 member knows almost everything there is to know about the Foundation and its activities. Between them all, they know every single secret that the Foundation holds. Most Foundation personnel spend their entire careers without seeing them. Members below clearance level 2 don't even know they exist. Most people outside the Foundation have never heard of them, or don't think they are real. Most everyone is afraid of them. An O5 walks into a room, and everyone pisses their pants. That's what happens when you hold supreme power over one of the scariest organizations in world history. This dossier will show you contradictory reports on each of the O5 Council members. My research has been comprehensive, but the very nature of my enemy makes it impossible to know which answer, if any, is true. Perhaps there are multiple individuals sharing each O5 number. Perhaps dozens. But perhaps there is only one. Perhaps only one of each of the reports are true, or all reports are different facets of one person with stand-ins and disinformation stirred in. Perhaps none of these are true. The end of this dossier presents 